Here's how to fix your iPhone volume buttons if they're not working. Now, if you're on your iPhone and you're trying to change the volume either up or down, and you're trying to use the physical buttons, but they're not working or not responding, I'll show you how to fix it. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, the first thing we'll do is you'll want to look at those physical buttons themselves. Maybe remove the case that is on your iPhone and just clean around the area and tap the volume up and volume down you should see the little slider right next to it going up or going down. If you don't see that, the next thing we'll do is head into your settings. We will scroll down until we see sounds and haptics, tap on that. And now you can see right under the ring volume here, you can see change with buttons. Toggle that on, which will allow you to change the volume here with your buttons and allow them to work. Now, if it's still not working, those buttons, either volume up or volume down are not working. Next thing we'll do is tap on general and then software update. Just update to the latest iOS 18.1, which is the current iOS operating system to see if there are any kind of bugs or glitches in an older operating system. So just by updating it, a lot of times fixes any of these issues. Now, the next thing we'll do is go back here and at the very bottom, we're just going to hit shut down. So basically shut down your phone and restart it. Maybe just by rebooting your phone, it will help to fix those buttons and get them working again. The last thing I would recommend doing on your phone is hitting this transfer or reset iPhone. And then let's hit reset and reset all settings. Go through the process of entering your password and resetting all of those settings on your phone and it will reboot everything and check the volume buttons if they're working at that point. If they're still not working, then I would recommend taking it into an Apple store. They'll plug it in, run some diagnostics and tell if maybe there's a hardware issue with the physical buttons themselves. Maybe they need to be replaced or maybe your entire iPhone needs to be replaced. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.